Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Kimberly. I'm back as promised with my first wash of my starter locks. I installed them two months ago, June 16th, 2024. I did the loose braid and band method to wash my hair. I was very nervous that if any of my twists come undone, I'm just gonna take them out. I had sister locks a few years ago and I used to do this method before they matured so I'm hoping for the same results. This is just an example of me washing my hair with a braid and banded. I just wanted you to see what it looks like. I'm about to head back to the sink right now. But I'm all done. And here's what my hair's looking like. Nothing came undone. Here's a close-up of my scalp. It's all nice and clean. Now, although I braid and banded, I was still worried about these two locks coming undone, but they stayed together. Now, these are the products I will use today to retwist my hair. Going forward, I plan to just use oil to retwist my hair, but we are headed out for our beach vacation, and I wanted my hair to be a little bit more polished, you know, for my vacation. I don't plan on swimming. I'm just going to, you know, be out there on the beach but I still, you know, want to do a little something for it to look pretty decent because we'll be around friends and family. All right. Now, I'm left-handed. So, my retwist will look backwards to most people. I can't twist clockwise for nothing, which is going to the right. I try, but I still revert to going counterclockwise, which is to the left. So, I just want to put that out there that I know I'm going in the opposite direction of everyone else you know how they do it I'm sure there's people who are left-handed and go counterclockwise but I'm just saying if you're watching my video you're like hey why are you doing it the other direction that is why now I also want to say that I'm not a loctician or a beautician I am just sharing my lock journey in case there's somebody else out here in 2024 that just started their journey and you just want to watch somebody do their locks and how it progresses and things like that that's all i'm not going to come back you know every week and share you know something about my hair i would just share going forward any changes when it starts budding and turning into you know more of a mature lock um, I want my hair to just do whatever it wants to do. That's why I just want to use all to retwist it. It just, I don't know, because I'm still thinking if I want to semi free form. I'm not real sure, but at this point, I'm just going to kind of just let my hair go and do what it wants to do. But I will be sharing with y'all, you know, as I go along the changes and then once it locks all the way. I will be done sharing. All right, I'm going to go and sit under the dryer and I'll come back when it's all dry and show you the end results. All right, I'm back. All done. here so hopefully you can see the you know the twist trying to get up close but the twists are, are pretty much they're like <laughs> still intact you know see yeah, let's see here. Let's 
trying to make sure that you can see. So yeah, I did it. First we twist by myself. Uh, okay, I <laughs> hope um, it you know stays together. The braid and band didn't mess anything up. Let's see, still. You know, just want you to see like the, you know, the, the, the tips, what do you call the ends? That's what I'm trying to say. See, it didn't mess up anything. Yeah, see? Okay. And where's my problem child? Here's my problem child right here. This one. It's, hang, it's hanging in there. It is hanging in there. Okay, and then other problem child was, what was this one? I think it's this one. All right, so I am going to go. I'm headed out for the evening. I'm going to finish getting ready. And uh, I just wanted to share that with y'all. So. Thank you all so much for watching and I will talk to y'all in my next video. Bye.